Howdy partner, it's me, your favorite YouTuber, Alpha Moto is back with another Red Dead online content. Today's video is about to how to be rich entrepreneur, not in real life, but in the wild wild west. In this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step tutorial with the nitty-gritty details of Trader English to earn $500 and 2000 XP for a single local delivery. <laughs> When I first heard of this glitch on a subreddit trade, I thought it might be a scam. When I tried out, oh boy, holy mother of glitch. An absolute bomber's glitch for making loads of money quickly in Red Dead Online. This glitch is going to make you the richest in no time. You will be so rich that you will have no idea how to spend all of that money. I wish it was true, everything in this game is way too costly, so I will be definitely doing this glitch probably every day for at least hundreds of times. And you will also wish that Rockstar will never going to publish a patch to stop you from doing this glitch. I wish Rockstar is not hearing me making this video. And I also want to buy everything in Wheeler and Rosen catalog. This is a step-by-step -step glitch tutorial, so you need to follow along very carefully to perform this glitch. By the way, if you haven't seen my previous video where I explained the trader rule, I am putting a link on the description below. Make sure you watch the video to learn how to rank up faster in Traded Online as a trader. Alright, let's jump right into making pile of money. Well, we worked so hard to build a little house together. In the snow or the rain or the ice cold wind, whenever, no matter what the weather, we're together. This is a trader rule co op glitch. First thing you need to have is your posse to play with. For each goods is being delivered, you will receive $500 rated online money and 2000 XP, but the posse leader will receive nothing. In my case, I and my friends have done this on a rotation so that we all could earn money and XP one after another. Speaking of posse, I would like to introduce you my three favorite posse leader before moving to the details of performing the glitch. They are the people who helped me a lot from the very beginning of my online journey. If you ever come across to them, show them a respectful bow or a hat tipping, who knows, you might get a perfect animal carcasses if they have any on their horse back. On the other hand, if you try to show any kind of disruptive griefing act, they will definitely make sure that you will never kill another online player in the future without any reason. I'm leaving their online player ID in the description below so that you can join their posse if you are new in this game and you need to rank up faster. Alright, to do this glitch, you need to take your camp's butcher table to a certain state. You need your material section to be plentiful where you can't donate any more raw materials. Your goods need to be full and for goods being 100%, your production would be halted. This is another cool side of this glitch. You will never need to hunt animals or play a resupply mission for your trading company. Your raw materials and goods will always remain max no matter how many times you play the delivery mission. First thing you need are a few basic setups before performing this trader glitch. If you have already reached rank 15 for traders, I would recommend you to buy a hunting wagon and the large delivery wagon to be able to reach maximum raw materials and earn full $500 and 2000 XP faster. If you haven't ranked up already, play as a posse member for 2 or 3 delivery mission and receive 2000 XP boost each time your leader delivered the goods. Once you rank up, unlock these two items from your progress menu so you can help your friends to earn something as well as because you don't want to be a cowpoke like Micah, right? I'm going to show you the glitch from a posse member perspective so you guys can see how much money and XP you would gain as a beneficiary for running the glitch. On average, you will be able to run this glitch 5 times in every hour and that's gonna be total up to $3,150 for every posse member and on top of that, there is gonna be 12,500 XP for every single hour for everyone. This glitch works for both local deliveries and distant delivery. For local delivery, each of your posse member will receive $500 and 2000 XP and distant delivery, they will receive $650 and 2500 XP. Usually, I prefer local deliveries because you can perform the glitch more quickly comparing to the distance one. Another thing you need to keep in mind which is what you should be doing when you are a posse member allotting to receive the free money and XP. 
You would most likely want to stay at the camp and have some fresh hot cow poke stew and expecting to get the paycheck of $500. Please don't ever do this, I have tested it with myself. If you don't follow along the delivery wagon, you will only receive $2500 and 500 XP. I know you might be thinking that most of the delivery mission don't require you to encounter in PvE gunfight but if you don't go with the delivery wagon, you are not going to receive the full amount of money and XP. Let me know commenting below if you did this and get penalized. Alright, since I have covered almost all the details of this glitch, now it's time to talk about the most crucial part of this glitch which is the delivery time and the technique to finish the glitch. For delivery time, try to finish the delivery mission as early as you can. If you pass the half time of the total given time of our delivery mission, this glitch will not work. Furthermore, keep your thumbs ready on the PlayStation Home button. Completing the delivery mission and hear the bell notification sound, you need to hold up the PlayStation Home button to bring us the quick action menu and from the action menu close the app. For this mission, my posse leader, the Outlaw 420, has left his posse outlaws for life for closing the game. So all of us were no longer in the same posse. Meanwhile, my another friend, 2 Daydream, has reopened our posse wireless. Now what the Outlaw 420 is going to do is come back to our lobby and join in our session as another posse member and become the beneficiary for the glitch. Our current leader, 2 Daydream, on the other hand, will no longer receive any money or XP for the next delivery mission. You guys can follow this cycle and run the glitch with your friend as many times as you can. If you want to see more gaming video, you can comment down below to give me any suggestions on which I can make next video.